out to so I had to draw a soldier a British it's gonna be a British infantry soldier and so I'm planning this out um, very very simple kind of way so this is the head we want the box for the body and I'm gonna put the the leg coming like that so he's kind of advancing forward kind of like that he's gonna be holding a gun so I'm gonna put this this is kind of stick figure kind of stuff um, and he's going to be holding a gun like that and that's basically what we need to start off with um, now to draw the helmet what we want is a curve right about there another curve there and that'll be the inside and then it needs to come over the top of the head and it's sort of quite round it's a it's a kind of standard distribution curve if you <laughs> remember about that stuff and so I'm going to start off drawing that part there and then the rim of his helmet there so that will be going like that and he probably wants some ears sticking out there maybe some sideburns and then we want to see his head uh, I'm going to give him very simple eyes this is going to be actually part of my drawing cartoon people series on Patreon and I'm going to show the whole of this video and how to paint him at the end on Patreon so you can go and watch that there if you like um, now we want two little bits coming down there to a V here and then turn these lines into boxes for his collar so it's kind of a box there and a box there and we're going to want his shoulders up here and we're going to start with this arm and bring that around so it's a bit of a curve and then this will be his cuff and we want kind of a wiggle wiggle in there and a wiggle wiggle up there and that's the cuff we're going to want the thumb and then the hands holding the gun here now I'm not making this gun particularly accurate uh, I think we're going to want something like that and we're going to want to have a trigger there and uh it's going to look something like this um and we're going to want to have a hand here with his thumb holding it out there this will now come forward with the barrel and then we're going to want to add a bayonet on the end Put a bit of a cross hatch there for for the handle. So now here that can come down to there. This can come here, and we'll have the cuff about there. And again, we'll have a, a sort of a wiggle up there in the armpits. Now he's going to need to have a sash coming across here, which is going to be holding his um, gas mask case there. He's also going to have stripes straps I should say coming down here with a little kind of ammunition pouches might be another one there and there's going to be a belt in there as well we want to have a line down the middle and some buttons and he's also going to have pockets there underneath the straps he'll have lapels over the top there and he's also going to have a pack on his back there now from the belt we're going to have the kind of the skirt of his jacket underneath the belt and then we'll bring the leg down there like that and then we'll bring this leg down there at that kind of an angle we'll bring it here with a bit of a wiggle and then we want to have these putties or strapping uh, I'm sure there's a word for it I'm sure someone will tell me in the comments <laughs> I'm sure I probably know it myself now the feet curve this down and then that will come a little curve there and this will come around and then 
those will be his boots there. Curve that round, bring that down and around there a bit. That's the heel, that's the sole. Do a little curve there and up, a little curve there and across. He's going to have laces there, like that, and there'll be a little bit on the heel as well. Now when you are sure that the ink is dry, <laughs> then you can erase all those pencil lines and we can put some kind of crumbly mud because that's everything was covered in mud wasn't it in the background there and I think I think that is probably all I'm going to do I think I might actually just put a bit of kind of darkness underneath there and we could maybe put a little bit of shadow underneath the helmet there but then once you start doing that then you feel you have to start putting it everywhere that's the problem 